out here with an older um, trailer yeah. and you can see it's a straight shot going straight back into the tank and this one has a little leaking problem and uh, they're not ready to fix that yet so we're going to show you how to make a part that will clean this when it's a straight shot uh, that you can keep it cleaner longer even when they're leaking uh, if you hold that right there on that so the first thing we want to do is take the hose off and we're going to add a clear view adapter to it and take this very clever system out now with the clear view adapter we've got a drill we're going to drill a small hole on the top miss the keys. It should be just pretty close to size. Now we want to put it on a little bit of an angle. Making it as small as possible to get the hose in. That would probably work pretty well like that. Now I'm taking five foot of hose. You can take a little bit more. Uh, we got to open the valve here. We shove that up and we know that this is towards the back of the tank now and uh, we'll shut the video off hook up the hose and show you what it does this is the same hose attachment that we showed you on different videos on how to make it's the 3 8 hose adapter to a shutoff valve we've got the got the water hooked up and all we're gonna do now is turn the water on and we're in the back of the tank and well, you can see because the water is not coming out yet, we're blowing to the back and there is something up on this end that is blocking it because there's no water coming out yet. But if I, well, we've got the hookup sitting on here on a, this is on a uh, different kind of a hose, uh, the street sweeper hose attachment and you can pull it off as we just did. I have a 3 8 barbed adapter that's actually made to do this on the video. Um, Turn the water on. Now we've got to pull it back a little bit until we find out where the plug is. And we're just going to let it, leave it sit right there for a minute and fill up. Because when I, as I pull back, I'll hit the plug and it's going to start breaking everything loose. And, okay, pretty good pile of uh, stuff sitting in here in order because it's doing what it's doing so we're going to come back here and that's pretty much where it is what i'm going to do is sit in that area until that all blows out and just keep going back and forth until we get it all out and uh, this one works anytime you've got a straight shot going into a tank now it won't totally clean it like hydro flushing it will but it'll get it down Put tank tech socks in there and get the valve fixed and it'll be fine but this is a way to do it and because we kept that tight we don't have a uh, overflow problem and you can actually leave this hooked up and do this as often as necessary and just keep it clean uh, we're uh, we've got the toilet in the back of the tank so it's at the far end and we've been in this um, maybe maybe 10 minutes now and uh, it's starting to run a little bit clear. So 10 or 15 minutes you can do this and on these small trailers where you got a straight shot, maybe a motorhome, this method will work. Uh, if you put uh, Tank Tech's probiotics in it and let's, let it soften up the paper, it'll rinse it out clean and uh, it'll take a few, few weeks of treatment to do that, get everything rinsed out, you'll be good to go. Yeah, we're washing it all to this end. It's going to work just fine. <laughs>